downtown Ocean City exit, you don't have to pay any toll on the expressway. Did you know that? Uh -huh. And when I came out of the dryer in the wash, it was extra small. <laughs> I'll never forget that. That was many years ago. That's when your grandmother, I don't know, I did a wash and I, why I don't know where your grandmother was at the time. You know, everything around the house is still the same as it was six years ago when she died. It'll be six years this July. Six years. What branch of the government? The Department of Interior uh, and Interior. the Bureau of Indian Affairs, but I'm working in the trust responsibility Thanks. in real estate. Mm -hmm. And um, right now I'm, I'm doing typing and filing and things like that, but I'm starting work on... Where did you learn your typing? Um, well, I took a typing class when I was in high school. Yeah. But I How many words you do? Maybe 40. What? Come on. I, don't type I took two enough. years in high school and I did 80. Really? A male, yeah. Maybe I don't type that much. I don't type that much. I never typed after I got out of school. Mm. No, the most I ever typed was about 50. <laughs> I did 80. Really? Well, I only took it for one semester. One do you know what some typists do? What? How many words per minute? Yes, they do 120. 120, right. I know. 
Well, anyway, um, he started me working on a, on a computer and he's going to teach me how to program it. He said there's lots of room for me to move up. So, 45 to 4.15. Oh, I see. But only half hour for lunch then. An hour. An hour? Mm -hmm. You only work seven hours a day then. Mm, that's eight hours. 7.45, he figure from um, 8 to 4 is eight hours. Mm -hmm. And then there's the extra half hour there. Well, it took us three and a quarter hours. Went across the Dollar Memorial Bridge, went to the Harbor Tunnel. When we come back, there was a five mile line waiting at the Harbor Tunnel. Yeah. And there was a five mile line at the Dollar Memorial Bridge. It took us seven hours to come home. And she was a retired school teacher. What did they do? Oh, I don't know. They were. They were. Well, just back, back not in July, not in Maine. Oh no! Your mother and I drove up there. Uh, we drove up to Maine in July, and when I was uh, in July, the temperature was 122 in Maine, and the lowest temperature was in February of that same year, 23 below zero in February. Yeah, I've driven in 105 degree weather. Oh, wow. When Wayne lived in uh, Las Vegas, who did I used to take for a walk? Sherry or Wendy? Wendy in a baby coach. Temperature 114. Oh. I never even perspired. Well, the humidity was only 4 or 5%. Yeah. Never perspired at that temperature. <laughs> yeah, we were out there a month. I'll never forget one out of the uh, about that place. One afternoon, I went outside the house, and Las Vegas lays in the valley. We could see it pouring over in the mountain, about five or six miles away, and the sun was shining so bright, right in Las Vegas. All right, where he lived on the outskirts of Las Vegas. You see the rain coming down in the mountains. When we went to uh, in the station wagon, what was the name of the town just below uh, Los Angeles? We went to visit an aunt or an uncle of yours, of oh. your mother's. Englewood. Englewood. Englewood was it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Aunt Lucy and Uncle Mike. Yeah. Noah's Ark. Noah's Ark. <laughs> I caught you. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. The, um, this man that I work with always tells me those kind of jokes. He must be a laugh a minute. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's pretty funny. So what I you know the English language, Michelle? Uh huh. You know, most of the words in the English language are actually like spelled. Most of them. But there's one word. Like, you have great rapport with your daddy and your sisters and your friends. Do you know how to spell rapport? R A T T O R. Yeah. Yeah, but that's not an English word. That's a French word. It's in the Webster's.